Hi guys, so it's been a while since I actually talked to you guys directly. I think since I came back from um, South Africa, I haven't been here to chat with you guys and that's because I came back sick guys. I came back not feeling fine. I'm not even sure I'm fully recovered now and my ears are ringing. Oh, I love this light. My ears have been ringing like you know that pressure that you get in the cabin, that cabin pressure. But that pressure that you get in your ears when you are flying. Is it that experience? Yes, exactly. You guys, Amarach is here. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> we just finished filming for her channel and my channel, so please go and check her out. Um, I think I've, the video will be up by now. I'm not sure. Um, yeah. So as I was saying, Joe, um, that pressure that used to cause pain in the ear, I always get it though, like anytime I fly. But maybe because I did. Um, in total, I think I, I, I did eight flights in total. Five flights coming back, or four and a half, let me call it four and a half flights coming back, and um, three, flight, three flights going. And when I was coming back, I had flu like symptoms. I don't know, I was sick when I was coming back. So it, the pressure is usually worse when you're not, when you're having flu, especially when you're having like kata cough and you know, yeah, anyway. So normally for me, that pressure goes away like the next day, like anytime I get it and I come back maybe the next day or maybe the next day or that evening the pressure usually goes but for me it has not gone this is more than a week now I still have the pain inside my ears so I don't know if I should go to hospital for it or I should just keep taking medication or I don't know sure but yeah that's part of why I haven't been doing much but and I was really ill anyway but I'm fine now I'm good I'm better. How are you guys doing? How are you guys preparing for Christmas? Me personally, I don't really have much planned this Christmas. This is one of those Christmases where I really have not had much planned. Um, yeah, so, but I'll carry you guys along for whatever plan we end up with. We'll just have, have fun the way we can. Christmas tree needs to be set up. Yes, so. Yeah, so, you and Elizabeth should go and bring out the Christmas tree. So, the father will even set it up, Seth, for us, then we'll now do the decorating. Although I'm sure I can set it up, I don't know why I'm always leaving everything for him. But yeah, if he sets it up, we'll decorate our Christmas tree and we'll get ready to have fun and enjoy my favorite time of the year. Yeah, so anyway, I'm actually still clearing stuff here. Me, I have work to do, so I'll try and do as much work as I can. I'll see you guys later. You guys, I don't even understand what is going on. See? water leaf that i did not plant hmm? this is water leaf that i did not plant i see how well they are growing see you see i didn't plant this water leaf oh. they're literally growing in a very tiny piece of soil just look at this one look at how fresh this water leaf is hmm? now let me show you the ones i planted the ones we planted are not as so notice that water leaf when they grow on their own they grow bigger as in when they are separated, but when they are together like this, they grow small, 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 small. Don't yeah, it's pineapple for sale. <laughs> yeah, this is our one pineapple we're waiting for. All of us must chop them. Pineapple for sale, eight thousand. We'll replant the head. We'll use the back for zobo. We'll eat the inside. Fine. We'll use the roots for. <laughs> we must use everything. So I want to go and take care of my birds. They are my birds now because people I bought them for. They don't care and i've been feeling bad for those birds for a while so let me go and try to take care of them let me show you these are the birds and you know their cage i think they've put you see they put vegetables for them that place is good they've put food and water for them but i need them to come out so i can wash this cage very well cage is very disgusting hi Hi sunshine. Hi moonlight. Hello. Hey, oh. Hello. Where are you running to?
To, I've been feeling dizzy. I don't know what it is. I feel dizzy. Uh, anyway, I've been trying to put this. Um, I don't know what to call this thing. It's not even bendy rollers. It's like coilers or something in one of my headband wigs so that I can go back to wearing it. Is that my headband wig that I got from my first wig? The one that has the you know relaxed hair texture, kinky straight. Yes. So I just want to put that. These are how they look. I actually bought this for Cora's hair and I've used them once on Cora's hair and they really turned out very nice. You no know, Cora has, you know, um, Texlax hair that is quite long. So when I when I used this on her hair, they were so beautiful. So yeah, because of it, I want to now try it on this kinky textured hair. Let me see how it's going to look. Once I'm done doing it, I'm going to... I'm supposed to go and blow dry the hair, but I'm, I don't have that kind of time. So I'll put the hair under the sun. Uh, when I come back, I'll now blow dry it before I, you know, take out this... Um, coilers. I got this coilers from AliExpress. In case anybody is interested, I got from I got it from AliExpress. I can't remember how much it was, but it wasn't that expensive. Um, I buy a lot from AliExpress, so AliExpress, Amazon. Um, I think I've seen them on Amazon as well. In case you you know want to buy from Amazon, so I really absolutely love it. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm also going out to run some errands. I need to get a pair of shoes for Sophia. Um, for her birthday, she has this dress that I want her to wear on her birthday, but there was no proper shoe to fit it. So I'm gonna get the shoes for her. Um, what else do I need to do for Sophia? Uh, I need to get snacks for my hobby, just dried mangoes because I bought them. He didn't send me, I bought I said, This is for you. <laughs> and I kept it in the fridge. He, oh God, did not eat it now. Me, so I never done. You know, I now took it and ate. So, <laughs> so um, I need to go and buy it back for him. Um, I've been watching. A podcast here because I like watching podcasts uh, or long videos when I do things. So I'm watching a podcast here. Let me just finish up with coiling this and I'll go out. So we'll go out together, okay? Okay. <laughs> To get this shoe for Sophia, not this shoe, I mean, I want to get a shoe for her, but this is like her perfect size. This is the newest shoe I got for her, and it's her perfect size. So I just brought this one along to see if I can get the exact size, but in white. I need white or silver, or maybe even black. I don't want black, I beg, because her school shoe is black, but I want white or silver so it can go with her purple dress. Maybe a purple shoe, I don't know, not purple shoe. Anyway, I'm at this store on Transamadi Road, Unique Kiddies. So let me just go in and see if they will get anything, if they will have anything for her. Guys, I went out and I bought everything aside what I went out to buy. I bought this fan for my office. Um, I got lights to repair some of my office lights. I'm going to help me repair some or fix some. 
than this. Not too much. The shoe I was looking for, I didn't see. I just took this for reference, size reference. This is the kind of shoe. Whew. So tomorrow, I'll have to continue my waka. I have to go to other shops to just check for the shoes. I tried to see if I can just borrow shoes from Adana and just for the photo shoot and all that. But Adana does not even have. In fact, her mother now said I should help her look for shoes too for her birthday. So, because tomorrow is Adana's actual birthday, but on Sunday is the party. So, we have between now and Sunday to get shoes for her. So, anyway, I, I'll still go and check, even though I'm also checking for Sophia too. Sophia's birthday is in, on the 12th, which is like. Um, Almost two weeks, less than two weeks from now, actually. <sighs> anyway, I'm back now. I'm gonna go rest. I beg. This one was too much. Yeah. Hey, I should know it. You know, see, they did learn for school. Ah, ah. good job. Bouncing Ben, see? But, good job. High five. Clever cat, see? <laughs> Wonderful. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Our is working now. <laughs> Dippy Dog say, Duh, good job. Firefighter Fred say, Ooh, good job. So our breads are back. Hello. Hello, sunshine. Hustle if you want job. They're not finished, they won't fight us. If them they run, they're not big bad jobs. Hey, everybody should come and visit me. Sina is a co-op. That's it, eh? Why is everybody should come and form like? You understand my pain. Come and mind on my money. You see, go, 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 and they go, go, go. They come fight. Oh, it's kind of money we never seen before. Tell them. I want to do something. A day, a day, a day. Give them fantasy, kind money we touch, no darling. Like grass, carry her, carry her. Go. So, guys, that brings us to the end of today's video. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know if my vlog is complete. Oh, you know that.